Great writing begin. Welcome everybody. I'm Julia Ann, the festival director, and I will be your host for this special writers retreat. Heidi, Heidi, Heidi Meyer, Tete Otipoti Dunedin. It is a pleasure to welcome you here in person in days when we spend so much time, perhaps a bit too much time, behind screens. Let us celebrate that we can meet and be writers and be free with our voices. And when I say free, I mean be free. Please, you owe it to yourself to find your voice this weekend and to get us warmed up and started, because in a few moments we're going to hear from our Mayor on this brisk spring Sunday morning. I'm going to have a practice run and we're going to do a rowdy cheer. So on the count of three, the quickest way to do this, one, two, three, go, yeah, one, two, three. Yeah! yeah! Aaron loves words and books and music just like most of us do. And on behalf of us all, I would like to invite Mayor Aaron Hawkins to officially open the great write-in. Okay, everybody, show the Mayor how happy you are to be. One, two, three. Yeah! Uh, kia ora koutou, uh, ka mi nui ki koutou, kia ora. Uh, I'd like to acknowledge uh, the people of uh, Kaitahu, Katsimamui, and Waitaha as mana whenua of uh, this place uh, that we now uh, call Otapoti Dunedin, which feels somewhat appropriate as we stand on the steps of this grand monument uh, to our uh, colonial settler history. Uh, Olveston obviously has been the site of uh, many, many stories uh, and tall tales over the years, from uh, the Theoman family's time spent here to its more salubrious incarnation as the law faculty's staff room, uh, through to the tens of thousands of international guests uh, that we have shown uh, through Olveston in more recent times. And it's really exciting uh, that it will uh, once again, as a result of, of the great ride in this weekend, uh, be the catalyst uh, for a whole bunch more uh, tall tales and short stories. And welcome uh, to all of our out-of-town guests uh, and to our, our local writing fraternity. Uh, I want to thank uh, Julia for organising this and, and making this happen. It's not the easiest time uh, to be producing and presenting events. Uh, it takes a particular kind of bravery uh, just to try, so thank you. Uh, we're really proud of, of Dunedin's uh, designation as being a, a UNESCO a city of literature and part of the UNESCO Creative Cities Network. But uh, the designation itself is meaningless uh, without... Uh, the work that our community do to, to bring meaning to it by organising uh, events such as this, so thank you. Uh, I also want to thank uh, Jan and the team uh, here at Olveston. Uh, I mentioned the tens of thousands of international visitors that have been through this building. There haven't been too many lately, uh, but the Olveston team have done a, a tremendous job uh, over the last 18 months um, reconnecting with our own uh, local communities uh, and, and, uh, and organising uh, events that uh, bring people uh, back to the house who perhaps haven't been here for some time or in, in many cases in, in our local community here for the very first time. Uh, so great to see the, the house uh, and the garden uh, be used in those ways. So uh, thanks again to, to Creative New Zealand uh, who I think have, have chipped in uh, to make this happen and, and to all of the writers and tutors and people who have given their time and energy. Uh, we organised the day, uh, especially, it's a, a spectacular spring day uh, here in Otapoti, Dunedin. Uh, enjoy the weekend and uh, look forward to seeing uh, what comes uh, out of this uh, creative process. Nō reira, tēnā koutou, tēnā koutou, tēnā Kia ora.